Mm. Boy. They say that heaven is 10 zillion light years away. And just the pure at heart will walk a righteous street someday. They say that heaven is Ten zillion lights is away. But if there is a God, we need him now. Where is your God? That's what my friends ask me. And I say it's taking him so long Cause we got so far to come Tell me people Why can't they say that hey It's ten zillion light years away why can't the light of good shine God's love on every soul? Why must my color black make me a less man? Hey. For those who don't believe, you will never see the light. Where is your God? Where is your God? That's what my heart tells me. Yeah, Lord. I say it's taking them so long, cause we got so far to come. But in my heart I can feel it, yeah, feel his spirit, whoa, whoa, oh, feel it. You can feel his spirit. I opened my heart one morning and I sure enough could feel it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Listen, uh, on the uh, west side of things, there was a comment. That went through the air. There were some lucky souls that had a chance to see. We don't know where it. It was an asteroid. Um, it was rather. Well, it was a. It was a comet between a comet or an asteroid, and it flew through the northwest. In fact, they have it on the internet where they were. They were outside watching it. Like, oh my God! I think we talked about this the other day. Okay. Now. They're saying that asteroids have been passing close to the Earth virtually now on a daily basis, okay, because we just talked about this. So while there have been big asteroids and small asteroids passing very close to our planet, they did not pose too high of a threat. Now, but due to their close approaches, scientists classify many of them as potentially dangerous asteroids. Now, one such asteroid that is bigger than the Statue of Liberty is hurling down towards Earth, and it will come too close to the planet for comfort. As per report by NASA, this asteroid, 2005RX3, which is as big as a 390 feet statue hell 
and it will reportedly fly past the Earth on September 18th at 11.52 at a hair-raising distance of just 2.95 mile million kilometers. Okay, did y'all get that? It's at a hair-raising distance of just 2.95 million kilometers. The current distance from Earth is 11.52 million kilometers, equivalent to 0 0.78 astronomical units. The asteroid will be traveling at a speed of 17 kilometers per second. The asteroid 2005RX3 belongs to Apollo Group. It was detected on September 6, 2005. And according to sky.org, the space rock takes 690 days to complete one orbit around the sun. Its orbit farthest point from the sun is 350 million kilometers, and the nearest point is 108 million kilometers. It will make its next close pass to Earth on February 28, 2070, at 17.6 million kilometers. Now, uh, how are asteroids classified into near-Earth objects? And you want to know how NASA detects them? Well, however, this is an asteroid. This doesn't fall into the category of potentially dangerous asteroids. Reason being that a space rock that comes from uh, within the distance of 30 million miles from the Earth is classified as a near-Earth object by NASA. And any near-Earth object that comes within, say, around 4.65 million miles fall into the potentially hazardous asteroids. However, the asteroid 2005RX3 is not classified as a potentially hazardous object. And its size is estimated, though, although its size is estimated at 390 feet. Woo. Okay. You may ask again, what is an asteroid? Asteroids are small rocky objects left over from the solar system's formation around some 4.5 billion years ago. They orbit the sun and most they right, reside in between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter, also known as ast the asteroid belt. They are made of different kinds of rocks, and hence, no two asteroids are alike. Okay? So now, that has been your tech information for today and our solar system review. Stay safe out there, y'all, because you don't know where it's coming from. Okay? All right. If you like what you hear, subscribe and share my channel. And I hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.